I do have peppermints if you guys like. Oh, that's a double. Oh, I'll get it there. <laughs> Thank you. And I'm just taking a shot in the dark. I just got this feeling you guys are planning on hanging out where a lot of grass is. Yeah. Is there a lot of grass? You didn't go last night? No, we didn't go last night. You didn't want to go see Charlie Daniels? Nah. Yeah, there's a lot of grass there. <laughs> we went to one, oh, uh, what, a few years ago? I don't remember who it was playing. I mean, it's a good area if you stay where it is yeah. and don't go outside wandering too far away. How long has it been Uber? Uh, about 10 months. Here's a first for today. Last night wasn't, uh, from our standpoint, wasn't a good deal. Really? I don't think there was that many people there last night. Probably not. And I'm thinking, well, last night was more of the older. Yeah. Tonight will probably be a good one. And it was an older group last night, and the weather was eh. Yeah. It was pretty windy and iffy. Yeah, and everyone was like, eh. Yeah, everyone kept saying tonight will be me. Yeah, it should be pretty busy. This is a lot cheaper than a DUI. Yes, it is. Now that may change tonight. Yeah. <laughs> It'll yeah. still be cheaper than a DUI, but it may not be the same price as it is right now. Yeah, no, no. I always like to make sure people can understand that. Now, if it gets too high, which is what I would do if I was you, and you're in no big hurry afterwards, there's a couple bars in, within a couple blocks right there. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was the last time. We'll have a couple drinks and then we'll go back down. Wait till that price drops. I mean, because if it kicks it up to five times, you know, it'll be close to 50 bucks. Yeah. Drinks are cheaper than 50 bucks. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah the, first, the first time we come up, we were walking down to that martinis thing. Yeah. Is it just by demand, like how many people are one at one? So Usually it does, yeah. yeah. So if you look around that crowd, you see 10,000 people. It's going up. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> see, 5,000, it may not, because there's also, with these events, like last night, another reason it was kind of a bus for us. Bloomington has their bunch of drivers. Yeah. As soon as there's one of these events, they all come up to it. Really? So you double the amount of... Yeah. There, there was probably 100 to 150 drivers last night. Compared to a normal weekend night of 50. Yeah. yeah everybody's trying to cash in on that. Well, yeah. And they keep... And see, I find it very funny. It's like right now there's, I think, six out. Yeah, I didn't. I mean, a little map show there was a few, you know. And all these people, they only want to work when it ends. Like, you don't realize they got to get there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if there's a hundred people that are taking Ubers when it ends, there's a hundred people that had to take an Uber to get there. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And if there's only six drivers out, your odds of getting a trip go way up. Yeah. <laughs> Do you do this full time or is this just a nah, I just do it on Thursday, Friday, Saturdays. Thinking I'm gonna have to add Sundays when winter comes since they yeah. started that Uber Eats. Oh now, yeah. That is that just fascinates me. And I'm just got a feeling because right now it does fairly good. 
But I can see on football on Sunday. Oh yeah, they're having a <laughs> bunch of wings, oh yeah. Yeah, instead of just getting pizza or Pizza Hut wings, you can get a real wing. Yep. <laughs> Boy, I can make a kennel and set my own little wing shop on there. Really. Oh yeah. I mean, there's one chicken shop that most of the people like getting it now, and they're closed on Sundays. But the, the, since this started, they're like, we're really thinking about changing that one. Yeah. Well, football Sunday, that, that could be a key. Yeah. <laughs> you know, try it and see. Because they said they did Super Bowl Sunday, and it was just unreal for them. Everybody wants wings on football games. That's what I mean. You, you can now have, did it just pizza, you could have the whole full-blown yeah. food-type deal. Is that what? Change it slightly. So I'm thinking it might be a good deal to come out and do a little delivery during the day. Yeah, the first time we ever, me and a buddy ever, we were in Denver, Colorado. Of course, we were been out. He just picked us up. Where are you going? We're going to go to this bar. It's like 40 miles away. You mind if I come in with you? Hell no, let's go. <laughs> and I looked at him and went, now if you're coming with us, how are we going to get back? He's like, I got a couple buddies, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. I've had a few people offer before, and I'm like, yeah. And yeah, you some, of course, we're a bunch of cowboys. I've had a uh, big engineer going to China the next month. One person that I gave a ride from told me, it's like, yeah. The driver I had yesterday picked me up at the concert. He had the same wristband on. I'm like, and how did that go? He's like, oh, not good. Yeah. <laughs> and I, I just wonder how that would, you know, you get in, you see the guy's got the drinking wristbands and everything, just where you came from. Well, you're the one getting the ticket, not me. Yep, I was going to say, well, he's the one getting the ticket. As long as we all walk away, what the hell? That's another reason I put that magnet on the back of the car. Yeah. Because that's the one police see. <laughs> and we tend to pick up people during the drunk hours. Yeah. When they're looking for DUIs. And we tend to bend a few of the laws. So it's a lot easier to pull up. Oh, crap. And they will. I've seen it. They see that and they just back right off. And I'm like, that's worth the $5 it cost me to buy that. Yep. But I've also told non-Uber drivers, if you had a newer vehicle, buy some of them magnets. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, another buddy of mine, we were in Fort Worth. And he, uh, I bought a bunch of just Uber magnets when we're out partying. I think I'm an Uber. Just drive somewhere close and they'll with it. Uh-huh. It works. But now if you get to a vehicle, they do yeah. the rules and then they go, uh-huh. Yeah. Thank you very much. No problem. Have fun. Hopefully you have a good night tonight. Well, I'm hoping it does. See, it's starting to surge now. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you very much, sir. Yep, you have a good one. <laughs>